Hi guys, what I will try today is to uh, weather and dark uh, these bags that I, that's you know like leg bags but I'm going to use it on my bike for some you know like um, um, bags on the bike side bags on my bike uh, how I come to this because I lost the plastic uh, one of the plastics uh, from uh, my you know side plastic on my bike and for these bikes it's like stupendous money some 60 or 70 euros they ask for the bags or uh, uh, you know shipping from US is the almost the same price so I will use the side bags instead of the plastics and I will have a quite nice space for putting some small stuff tools and stuff like that what I want to do now I bought this on Fakanze and this one came from uh, China so but they are almost the same color a little bit different but almost the same and I want to them to look like this so weathering and a little darkener uh, I bought this on the flea market it's actually ammo pouches I hope you call that but they are weather like uh, naturally <laughs> you know by using and I want this one to look like this so uh, let me show you how I'll try to do that so first I will be using rubbing alcohol and you know clean them up with the rubbing alcohol to weather it a bit and remove uh, leather paint a bit so let me try this I actually do this first time in my life so yeah let's hope everything gonna be as expected Okay, so we clean it with a rubbing alcohol. Now I already uh, scratch the scratch pad this one, and now I will do this also on this one. So you know I have just uh, this scratch sponge and I will scratch it just down the lines where you used to find uh, wear marks on leather
And now I'm going to use the coconut oil. So this is a little bit lighter brown and this one is darker so I will use much more coconut oil on this one than on this one. Yeah, this one is getting darker, very nice, but this one is not, so I somehow doubt that this is the real leather. I, I really can't tell, but you know, this one is act differently and it was expensive one. I'm not sure I'd be able to darken this one as much as I want. Let's try. Because with this one, as you can see, I'm getting really close. And it's really nice. Look, I'm aiming to and it's really, really, I'm really satisfied with how it's getting darker and darker. I'm so, you know, sad I didn't buy two of these. And this one is just, you know, cannot get any darker than this and you see the difference yeah I will use for protection this cream that I bought uh, for leather protecting, you know. So just to be sure that it's moisture resistant. We have a nice layer. We'll leave it for a couple of hours. Now soap is really good with coconut oil. And we'll see what it's going to happen. I will be able to darken it even more. And here it is on the bike. So as you can see, it's a little different. notice 
something they are really more similar one to another thanks to the fact that I put these stains on them and talking about the red bike I couldn't figure out how I will put the stains so I just took with my fingers the residue and the gunk on my front wheel and like this you know and then just put it on the Back. I got this wear look that I'm aiming for so yeah I know this will raise some eyebrows but I like it how it's look it's much darker in, the, in, in real life than camera but I assure you the results are really nice I also did that on this back too and I got that wear look that fit my wasteland bike I'm very satisfied with the result so that's it. Thank you guys. See you.